Thank you for joining me. My name is Mr. Toya. Today we'll be looking at two digit by two digit multiplication. The first thing we're going to look at is the parts, other parts of a multiplication sum. Sixty-one is our multiplicand. Twenty-three is our multiplier. And the answer 1,403 is our product. The answer we get after multiplying is called the product. So the product of 61 and 23 is 1,403. Now, in this tutorial, I did 12 questions. Yes, because I know you need practice. So let's dive in. Our first question is 42 times 12. The first thing I do when I am multiplying by a two digit number is I put a zero here. Then I'm going to begin to multiply with the multiplier under the tens color, okay? So I'm gonna say one, two is two, and then one, four is four. After, I am going to multiply with the multiplier under the ones color, which is the two. Then I'm going to say two twos are four and two fours are eight. After this, I am going to add zero plus four is four, two plus eight is 10, four plus the one is five. So the product of 42 and 12 is 504. Let's do a next question. The first thing I have to do is put my zero, then I'm going to multiply with the multiplier on the tens column. I'm going to say three twos are six, three ones are three, then I'm going to multiply with a multiplier under the ones column. I'm going to say two twos are four, two ones are two, and then I'm going to add zero plus four is four, six plus two is eight. So the product of 12 and 32 is 384. Let's do our next question. The first thing I'm going to do is put a zero, and then I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the tenths column. I'm going to say two fours are eight, two ones are two. Then I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the ones column. And I'm going to say three fours are 12, Three ones are three plus the one outside is four. Then I am going to add zero plus two is two, eight plus four is twelve, two plus the one on the outside is three. So the product of 14 and 23 is 322. Our next question is 36 times 24. Put my zero, two times the six is 12, cross out the two, put it here, two threes are six and one is seven, it comes here, four times the six is 24, cross out the four and put it here, four threes are 12, 12 plus two is 14, then I'm going to add zero plus four is four, two plus four is six, seven plus one is eight. So the product of 36 and 24 is 864. Let's do our next question. We have 11 times 52. The first thing I'm going to do is put a zero here. Then I'm going to multiply with a multiplier in the tens column. Five ones are five, five ones are five. Then I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the ones column. So I would say two ones are two, two ones are two, and then I add zero plus two is two, 
5 plus 2 is 7. 5 plus 0 is 5. So the product of 11 and 52 is 572. Let's do a next question. I have to multiply 34 and 20. The first thing I need to do is put my zero. Then I'm going to begin with the multiplier under the tens column. I'm going to say two fours are eight, two threes are six. Then I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the ones column. Zero times four is zero. Zero times three is zero. Any number multiplied. Um, by zero is zero, zero plus. Now this plus sign, I'm gonna fix this. We're gonna add next. Zero plus zero is zero, eight plus zero is eight, six plus zero is six. So the product of 34 and 20 is 680. What is the product of 45 and 52? The first thing I'm going to do is to put my zero, then I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the tens column. Five fives are 25. Five fours are 20 plus two is 22. Then I'm going to multiply with my multiplier under the ones column. I'm going to say two fives are 10, two fours are eight, and one is nine. Zero plus zero is zero. Nine, five plus nine is 14. Two plus the one on the outside is three. Two plus zero is two. So my answer is 2,340. Let's do our next question. 37 times 35. Oh, you all should be getting this right. What should I do? First thing, I'm going to put my zero and I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the tens column. I'm going to say three sevens and then three threes. Three sevens are 21. Three threes are nine, 10, 11. 11 comes here. I have 1,110. Now I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the ones column. Five sevens are 35. Five trees are 15. 15 plus trees, 18. Now I am going to add zero plus five is five. One plus eight is nine. One plus one is two. And one plus zero is one. So the product of 37 and 35 is 1,295. I hope you all are working this out with me. The next step, the next question rather, is 45 times 25. What is the product of 45 and 25? The first thing I need to do is put a zero. Then I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the tens column. I'm going to say two fives are 10, two fours are eight, and one is nine. Then I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the ones column. I'm going to say five fives are 25, five fours are 20, plus two is 22. Zero plus five is five, zero plus two is two, nine plus two is 11. So the product of 45 and 25 is 1,125. What is the product of 94 and 21? What is the first thing I need to do? Put my zero. I'm gonna use the multiplier under the tens column. I'm gonna say two fours are eight and two nines are 18. Now I'm going to multiply with the multiplier under the ones column. So I'm going to say one four is four and one nine is nine. Now I'm going to add zero plus four is four and eight plus nine is 17. Cross out the seven, put it here. Eight plus the one on the outside is nine. 
bring down my 1. So the product of 94 and 21 is 1,974. My next question is 87 times 65. What is the product of 87 times 65? Let's see. The first thing I need to do is to put my zero. Then I'm multiplying with a multiplier under the tens color. I'm going to say six sevens of 42, cross out my two, put it in here, and six eights of 48, 49, 50, 51, 52. Then, I'm going to multiply with my multiplier under the ones color. I'm going to say five sevens are 35, and five eights are 40 plus three is 43. Now I am going to add zero plus five is five, two plus three is five, two plus four is six, five plus zero is five. So the product of 87 and 65 is 5,655. This is our last one, y'all. 65 times 12. What is the first thing I need to do? Put a zero, then multiply by the multiply in the tenths column. First, one, five is five, and then one, six is six. Now I'm going to multiply with the multiplier in the, under the one scholar, which is a two. I'm going to say two fives are 10. Two times six is 12 and one is 13. Zero, five plus three is eight. Six plus one is seven. So the product of 65 and 12 is 780. Thank you all for joining me. I hope you all write this down and practice. For those of you all who haven't subscribed to my channel yet, be sure to do so now. Bye.